Hi everyone, managing project-based finances, whether you're a freelancer, agency, consultant, who invoiced based on specific project progress is a common pain point. With multiple projects, keeping track of expenses for each one, income and profitability can become a real headache. In this video, I will show a simple solution to handle all of this within Excel. The Project Financials Profit Tracker. This is an all-in-one solution for managing your project financials for multiple projects and clients all in one place that will give you clear insights on your business performance to optimize profitability. So let's have a quick look at the template itself and see how we can help you. So this is the actual Excel template. It has several tabs, starting from the setup tab. Just go ahead and give your company a name. I will just name it New Media Agency. You can select your preferred currency to use with this template from a selection of uh, Euro, Dollars and Pounds. Let's go ahead and select Dollars. And we have uh, three tables here where you can customize your expense categories, your project types, and your income types. These are basically used in the reporting section just to have a better understanding of how your expenses and uh, income, your revenue are split into these uh, categories. To add, you can add as many categories as you want in each uh, table. Uh, let's go ahead and add one more expense category. I will uh, enter here media, capital media creation uh, project types let's add another project type television ad and the income types i will keep them as they are project progress performance based revenue and subscriptions so this is the setup uh, the setup tab moving on to the clients this is basically a list of all your clients i will add uh, a new client here let's name it client one uh, optional we can uh, describe what type of business our new client is let's say uh, it's a grocery store and you can add contact details for reference and again we can add as many uh, clients as we want following this uh, table Moving on to our projects list. This is again a list of all our projects. Let's enter our uh, new project. Name it television ad for summer. For which client this project corresponds to. Client one. Starting 29th of May 24, and we should uh, deliver this project by mid June. Has a duration of 17 days, and now the the budget column. The budget column is just for us. It's not the actual agreement we have with our client. Is how much we as an as a business we can spend in order to make a profit in relation to the agreement to the total agreement we made with the client for instance if we had an agreement with a client of uh, 3500 uh, my goal is to not spend more than 3000 in order to make some profit a profit of 500 so that's my spending expenses budget and the project type this is a television ad so now that we successfully created our categories in the setup tab, have our clients list uh, ready and our project lists ready. Uh, one more thing, in the project lists tab, there is a ready-made filter where you can click on a specific client and see the projects related to this uh, client. For instance, for Acme Corporation, these were the projects we previously had and this is our current client our current project client one so now we are ready the started the project will start and we are ready to move on 
registering our expenses. This is the expenses tab where we enter all expenses and assign them into projects for specific clients. And again, the, we have the same filtering uh, buttons to see expenses for specific clients. So let's start and enter our expenses for this uh, project. Enter the date, 30th of May 24, for which project this expense is related to, television ad for summer and the client, client one. Brief description of this expense. Let's write here stock photos and live animations. If you have an invoice for this expense, enter it here. The expense category. This is stock photos and videos. We bought 10 items, $50 each, totaling 500 as an expense. Then on the 5th of June 24, again, for which project this expense belongs to and the client description on site photoshoot enter our category media creation that was one time fee and uh, it was for 1800 so we spent 1800 on the actual photoshoot and our last expense on the 10th of June 24 again for this project and client description for this expense let's say it was a video editing expense again it belongs to the media creation expense category and one time payment 500 so these are our expenses if you want to see expenses for a specific client click on the filtering button for client one and these are all the expenses for our client moving on to the income tab again this is where we enter all our income for specific projects and clients so on the 15th of june 24 we delivered our final uh, television ad to our client one uh, complete project delivery we issued an invoice and uh, this is a uh, based on a project progress uh, payment and they pay at and they paid us the agreed amount of 3500 now let's go and see our reports this is the actual uh, report page from the drop down here you can select the actual project for which you want to see a report this is here television ad for summer and immediately all the information the financial information for this project are populated into the report sheet we have a complete list of all of our incomes and expenses for this specific project uh, breakdown analysis of our expenses you see here we have two categories for this project for this specific project two categories of expenses and one category as uh, revenue project progress and we have a financial uh, summary our spending budget was 3000 start and end date with 17 days uh, duration total income was 3500 this is how much we got paid these are our actual expenses 2800 so comparing the actual expenses to our original budget did we go over budget no and we had 20 dollars to spare breakdown of our income versus expenses we got paid 3500 with our incurred expenses of 2800 so we made a profit of 700 dollars which corresponds to 25%. So this is our income and our expenses. And again, the same type of uh, reporting, but this time on a client base. Uh, if you have clients with uh, multiple projects and you want to see how a specific client is performing, just select your client here and you see the whole expenses and income um, 
entries for all projects for this specific client together with uh, analysis of uh, profit and over budgets. If for instance our expenses for this uh, project went a little bit higher than the original expectation, let's say instead of 1800 for the on-site photoshoot we had to pay 2300, immediately the report has changed. As you can see we had expenses of 3300, we went over budget we went over the amount we have set as a limit, 3000, so we went over budget by 300, but because our payment was 3500, we made a, a smaller profit of only $200, 6%. So you can see how powerful these uh, reports uh, can be for your business. You can analyze all your current projects, how they are performing during and after the final uh, delivery and make better decisions for your future projects in order to optimize your profit and be able to give better quotes to your clients. Simple to use and yet powerful template for your business. The link to find this Excel template is provided in the description below. Remember to click the subscribe button. Thank you for watching.